Hello my invisible friends on the far side of the computer screen. Welcome to this very short video that I have put together at the request of some of my colleagues here at ECE. I hope you find it useful. We are at the end of the term. The final grades for our courses are in a spreadsheet and are ready to be uploaded. This is how I did it. We begin by logging into Workday then select the teaching option. Among the instructor's activities that appear, click on more at the bottom. Now we're talking. Select the final grade submission tool and a list with all your assigned courses appears. Let's suppose that I want to enter the grades for my circuits analysis one course for the second winter term of 2024. Click on its name and the class list will appear. Down here on this corner there is this tiny little icon to download the class list. Click on it. The downloaded Excel spreadsheet has three rows at the top that can be deleted. They can be deleted, I deleted them, and has four extra columns that must be removed as well. Those columns are titled Photo, Academic Level, Primary Program of Study, and Grading Basis. Remove those four columns. In this picture, I have relabeled them, those three columns, as just X, Y, Z to save space and make it easier to fit it in the screen for the video. I repeat, remove the photo columns and also the three columns between the student's last names and the grades column. Now populate the grades column and we are ready to upload the grades. In the same page from where you downloaded the list, click on the big blue button Upload Grades. Another almost empty screen appears. Click on this small Upload button and it will ask you for the file name. After that, click on the bottom right on the Validate button. Once the process is complete, you will see two options, Save or Submit. Do not submit the grades until you are sure because once you submit the grades, they cannot be modified without a change of grades request sent to the head of the department or equivalent. And that is all for now. Thank you for watching, and I hope to meet you again in our next video. And cut. That's a wrap.